Good day everyone. Learn how to separate drive in Windows 11. Or I would say how to create a partition like D drive in Windows 11. So here in the start icon, you need to do a right click and then go to disk management. Once the disk management is opened, you need to carefully look how many volumes you have. So as I can see, let me maximize it. So I can see these are the same things like C and here. These are the same thing. And I can see I have C drive and the capacity is 459 GB and free space is 342 GB. That means I can create a D drive of 300 GB 320 GB, 340 GB like that because I have the free space in the C drive. So you need to keep that in mind and then create the D drive because we will be taking the space from the C drive and we will separate a D drive. So to do that, the very first step here is to click and check do you have any unallocated space or not here if you already have a unallocated space that's great you can add more onto it but since you do not have any unallocated space so we will take the space first and then we will name it the d drive so i'll do a right click and we need to click on shrink volume now the moment you click on shrink volume you might think that this is hang or it is stuck, but it is actually working. So once you click on that, leave the mouse as it is. So it should not take much time. Now, here, let's say if I want to create a 50, 50 GB of D drive. So I'll mention 50 GB like the round off amount. 50 GB so it 1 GB equals to 1024 MB so I am have to enter for 50,000 you can convert into MB whatever the GB you want to and then you just need to click on shrink so I'm just giving you an idea so it's not exactly 50 GB it's a little less than 50 GB so it's actually shrinking now you can see I have 48.3 48.83 GB unallocated space. So now I can create this unallocated space to the D drive, like I will um, separate the drive. So I'll just do a right click on that. And now we will click on new simple volume, next. And we will assign the letter. So in my case, I'll select D, I'll click on next. And file system should be NTFS default volume label and make sure the check mark is there else it will it will take much time to format i'll click on next so basically you don't have to do anything just click on next and click on finish and you can see the d drive has been created so i'll click on my file explorer you can search the file explorer from here and once you find it, go to this PC and here we have new volume. So this is how you can separate drive in Windows 11. If you find this tutorial short and helpful, please don't forget to hit the like and subscribe and do share this tutorial with your loved ones. And please take the membership as well. I'll be glad if you do so. Do support me. Have a wonderful day. Take care.